Hello everyone, Sean here once again. It is June 14th, 2022, and we're back with another daily Nerdle. As always, please take a moment to like and subscribe, it really does help me a lot. But for now, let's get into today's puzzle. Alright, it may look slightly different today. We zoomed in just a little bit because we've got ads flanking both sides trying to creep into here. No free advertising on here. Alright, we have a single digit number. We know that because we don't have a two and we don't have any increasing operators. So it must be a uh, single digit answer. Uh, where that is, don't know. Let's try and figure out. Let's see. If we have, using the numbers that are provided so far, 32 over four would be eight. We can then subtract out six to test two again. Now let's subtract out five to test a three over here as well. Oops, equals equals. Okay, not necessarily on the wrong path. This is gonna be division, so it can't be two divisions either. This must be a, must be a triple digit number divided by a single, a, a, double digit number. So this is going to be interesting. Uh, we also don't start in the 300s. Let's try starting in the 200s. So 200 something divided by something else equals 3. I think we're going to be able to narrow this down pretty quickly here. So there's no one. This, the minimum this can be on the left side here is two, three, two. So this has to be at least a seven. We don't have to be as high as 80. That would be 240. We can go as low as um, 78. So if we do that, it's 21, uh, 210 plus 24, and then put a four there. Let's try that out. Okay. Absolutely on the right path here. So not in the seventies. It means it must be in the eighties. Um, so two, I'm just going to type in the zeros for now. I'm going to fill those in very shortly here. Something in the eighties equals three. So we have a second three. It certainly could go here. Could it though? Because we would need to multiply three by something to end in three, and that doesn't really work. Anytime you multiply anything but one, you end up with something else. So the three cannot go there, it must go here then, which means we already know the answer. This is going to be 249. Awesome. Just falling right into place there. It was a little trickier. Certainly did have to use a little bit of a uh, little bit of logic to, to narrow that down, but it did kind of fall into place. Had a lot of people uh, recommending we do more nurdles. I think that's the one of the specialty puzzles that people miss the most. I think what we might do is drop the Dirtle and just alternate Nerdle and Quirtle on our Monday through Saturday days. That uh, that sounds a little more fun for me. I do really enjoy the Nerdle, and I know a lot of you do too. So let me know in the comments what you think about that. That would be basically be alternating Nerdle and Quirtle back and forth, and of course doing Hurdle on Sundays. Let me know. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe. It really does help me a lot. And share this video with anyone you think would enjoy some daily math puzzles. That's all for now, and we will see you all tomorrow.